it sometimes feel like you are stuck just pushing out extractions and reports? That all you're doing is doing the extraction, pushing it out to UFDR to hand off to someone else, not having time to actually do your forensic examinations. Well, Celebrate Autonomy can help alleviate some of that pain. Get back to forensics. What it is, it's a server-based solution with a simple Windows installer and can be scaled out to as big as your agency needs. It uses workers to be able to handle more data. As extractions are completed in the folders that are monitored, it can automatically start decoding them into a UFDR report uh, with some preset uh, information. Let's take a look to see what it looks like. This is a server-based solution and does require a high-end Windows server-grade machine with each of the workers having a suggested of 120 gigs of RAM. The more workers you have, the more data it can process. It all starts with workflows. A workflow is what it sounds like, the workflow for each of the workers. You can create specific workflows to monitor specific directories. You can set the type of decoding parameters that you would like to apply to each extraction. What type of enrichments you were applying to the extraction, whether it's hash matching, whether it's recovering additional data from uh, deep carving or media classifications. And of course, setting time zones and uh, making it relevant to the actual device that, that is being processed. And most importantly, the output format of how you want this data to be outputted, whether you want uh, MD5 hashing to be done as mentioned before and whether it goes into a UFDR or some of the other export formats that we do provide. From the main window, you can monitor the progress of how many pending cases or pending files that are still need to be processed, which ones are complete, where they sit, and the output of them and how long it took to run. So in closing, Celebrate Autonomy can help automate some of those mundane tasks that take up a lot of time for you, let you back to processing more devices, clear out the backlog, or get back into deep diving into forensics.